Hi there, we are back once again to give you exciting videos and today's shot is going to be very specifically on how to convert holes and ribs to counter action. Just enjoy this. Follow it up keenly and study, learn alongside. You you will find it very interesting to work with. Okay? Uh, this is the first uh, way of how to free yourself or convert the hold or grab to an action, a counter action. Now, first of all, he holds on the hand. Look, that's one pound. That's the completion of it. You move one sequentially. You strike here. When you strike here, you go there. Why do you strike here? If you take, you can, you can as well do this. Now, doing this one will take you another second to go that. So you are now. We want to convert the hold directly to action, counter action at once. That is why here is most appropriate because here will help you to achieve this. At the same time while here will give a longer time for you to do that because it is the bending here that gives you the the, the the opportunity to counter the strike or the hold immediately like like that okay now we take it smoothly and we go ahead with another one like I said that's one Okay, uh, all right. Is a, what is a, if someone holds you two hands? Uh, probably the person is a huge, huge guy, maybe one of these body view that holds you firm. Okay, yeah. all right. That's a very good question, viewers. Because sometimes you think it is all about the firmness of the hold or the grip. Yes, that also matters. But what matters also the most for you to free yourself is the technique, the systematical way you know how to manipulate. Because if you do not have the, the skills, the technical way of manipulating it, the, the firm grip or the firm hold will keep you there. You cannot free. So now, this is two hands, firmly grabbing this hand now how do i free this hand now going this way will somehow make it a bit difficult for me to if i actually want to take this and counter immediately but if i have to look for another way i can do this uh, now grab please okay let me see I pretend as if I'm going in. I hold my hand, my fist, there. Then I do this. Mm. No matter how hard this hold or the grip is, once you do this, like I said, it is all about the skill, the technicality of applying it. I sink in here. He does not know what I'm about to do. I sink in here. Then I sink myself in. And I strike now with the jack. I am striking with the elbow at once. Uh, there. The last thing is that these two fingers could not. Press it, it could not press it down. My two thumbs. It will. It, it will down. never press it down because I follow the direct sequence. Sink in. Mm. With the force and two, you do not have any idea of what I'm going to do. Yes. So I just sink in. And you're thinking I am about to struggle to free my hand, but you don't know that I have something technical in mind to do. That's. Okay. Now, that is for two hands. Still grab the two hands. There's something else. Now, I was I was about showing this. 
I said, if you do this, the delay of counter, because I so I told you that we are we are converting the hold directly to a counter action, which means as you're freeing, you are striking. Now this you can equally free here, but it's going to give a, 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 a second or two delay for you to counter. That is this. You see there? You free and then you counter. So it's going to delay the counter. So it is not that you cannot do this, but you can do it. But if you are following what we just said, that you have to convert the grab or the hold directly to a counter action, then this might not go because it takes seconds for you to take the counter action. So most appropriately, I I, I, I advocate for this. Okay, it has to do with the double bit. Okay? Now, uh, what if I grab with this other hand? That first one did it with this hand. Okay. So but this one, I think it should be different from this one. Yeah. Okay. Now from here, you can decide to do this. Sink yourself in as if you are going in. Strike here. Hey. And when you strike here, you pull here out. Palm and come back. Okay, now let us, after this now, let's see another way of uh, holding, another kind of hold or grip. Then we'll still see how we can put ourselves compact it. All right, now let's, let's check out the next kind of hold or grip and see uh, how to escape or combat it okay back to action now this get a hold of where you want you want to okay now free it now you realize i couldn't talk because of the hold so you know that it is not a play it's effective when you grab somebody there at the neck so that's why i asked him to free first let me explain now he is not going he doesn't know what i'm going to do that's how it goes to you or anybody who will be able to learn this skill and apply it it's as simple as it but just have to follow the, the skill the, the, the sequence now take okay. get the hold again ah! Simple as that. All right. Now let me explain what happens. Why he has to fall like that. Now you take the grip, grip just lightly, so that I, I take the explanation. Now he doesn't know what I'm going to do, so he's careless. He just grabs. He thinks he's 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 in he's, he's, uh, he's in control. Now I took my hand here. He thought maybe I'm stretching to grab him, but no, I'm very relaxed. Now what I do is I thrust, double thrust him, just around the elbow, inwardly, sticking my body backward, bam, I strike down. Okay, that is what happens. Now, this same way, let's assume him, let's assume him, he did not fall. After the strike, pop, he still hangs. Now what happens next is leaving one hand here to bring this closer again with hey. that. Uh, so viewers, please follow keenly. This is very, very interesting. It's easy to apply. Just follow this. Well, the last but not the least for today. So let's see. I want to, I want to grab you with two hands. I think I want to kill you. Okay. All right, good. That's another way, because viewers, one or two persons might want to ask that question. That what about two hands? Two hand grab. Okay, now grab. You see that? Then it doesn't end there. When you strike there, you realize he comes close. Now from here, you can take this palm straight to the nose. Boom. Okay. The action goes one time. He grabs. Think in. Boom. There. Boom. That's it.
nothing. It doesn't matter how hard you grab because the strike on this hand is shocking the hand. And you're not, you, you don't just strike carelessly, you strike hard. And in between, all this happens in the middle, the inner part of the elbow. Strike, boom, it goes. And he pulls himself closer, then he strikes. All right. Yeah. Okay. We're going to leave you there today. This I know you're going to find this very, this very interesting. This I remind you, do not hesitate. Hit the bell, subscribe, and uh, wait for the next action as we come your way.